what we're building now is, is what we call a travel product. So we, we're putting the stations up in between major cities, uh, allowing people that, that, would nor that normally drive far uh, or every now and again has to drive from one major city to another major city. And then next wave, uh, we'll put them closer to the major cities uh, and traffic hubs sort of to, to broaden their perspective a, a little. Um, but, but yeah, the, the general idea is that you, you use it whenever you need to, really. I mean, 80% of the Danish EV drivers, they charge at home. Uh, most of it is just done at home in your driveway, but now that we have these, if you, don't, if you don't have a driveway, or you don't have access to an AC charge at home, then you can just go and swap the battery every Sunday or every other Sunday whenever you need it. The station is aligning the car at the center of the lane. In a minute, it's gonna lift us up a little bit to make sure we're level. Then it's gonna eject the uh, depleted battery, move it to a waiting position, load the fully charged battery into the car, close itself up, and then basically let us go. It removes your range anxiety, hopefully, uh, and it means that you, you save a lot of time by swapping as opposed to charging. At the same time, the, the batteries, uh, we charge them fairly slowly. So we have a lot of batteries in the station and then we charge them slowly because it, it means that the battery cells themselves degrade at a slower rate, so they live longer. And then when they, when they run out of that, then we can take them back, we can clean them and we can put them back in circulation. So it's, it's, it's more of a, we're taking on the responsibility of making sure that this part of the vehicle, this part of the engine stays healthy. One of the, 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 the issues or the, the main disadvantages for the time being of, of Neo Power Swap is that you need to you have to drive in a Neo car to make uh, to use the, the Neo battery power swap stations because there's there's no common standard it's only Neo vehicles for the time being so if a, a common standard is developed and Neo also wants to you know be able to swap batteries of other uh, car uh, manufacturers I believe that it could. Uh, have uh, quite a potential, but we need to have a common standard. We see a higher charging speed at superchargers, which means uh, definitely uh, reduced uh, charging time. Uh, you, can also you also have the long, much longer range that's getting more and more common in EVs. And you could say that, well, is it really that well in the battery swaps? Well, you could say if, if you're actually uh, considering uh, making the transition from an ICE car to uh, an EV, and you are not so keen on the idea of charging at all, then this could actually make sense with battery swap to that kind of drivers maybe.